Hey, and welcome to my Pilates online. I'm Amy. I hope you enjoy our session this morning to get our bodies moving and have an awesome class. Let's stand with the feet hip distance apart. We're just going to start with a nice deep breath in as we breathe in, lifting the arms up. And exhale, blow it all out. And I just want you to drop your head, chin to your chest. Take a breath in here. Exhale, roll it up. Length and length and grow tall for your shoulders to wide. Breathe in. And exhale. A little bit further, head and the shoulders just hang. Feel that stretch in your upper shoulders. Breathe into that space. Exhale, rolling it up. Length, grow tall, shoulders draw wide, fingertips lengthen to the floor. And inhale. Reach to the ceiling. And exhale. Drop your head, your shoulders, and two more vertebrae into your mid back. Feel that stretch in the spine. Breathe into that space. Opening up the back of your ribs and exhale, rolling it up. Length and grow tall, reach the arms. And exhale, rolling it down. Two more vertebra, head, shoulders, mid back, into your lower back. Keep your pubic bone tilted towards your face. Hang here. Feel that opening into your lower spine. Hold it as we breathe in. One more breath here, breathe it up. And in. And exhale. Reach the arms up, stretching into your sides. Pull. And reach and pull. Good morning, body. Pull. And pull, reach. Two more. Reach. And reach, interlace the fingers, stretch them up, and hold it there as we go. Two more breaths. It's good for your heart. One more. And just a gentle twist. Last one, back to center, and release the arms, opening the chest slightly, and big shoulder roll back for five, four, three, two, last one, and reach the arms up, interlace your fingers, think. Index fingers stretching up to the top. Pull your shoulders down, soft bend in your knees. I want you to feel like you're going up and over. Get a nice big side bend. Breathe in. Connect into your abdominals and obliques to come up. Breathe in and over. Hold it. Inhale. Exhale, connect. One more on each side like this. Breathe in. Exhale. Up and over. Reach. Stretching out of your fingertips. In. One more in. And out. Hold it. And exhale. We're going to go all the way around. Swap arms. And lift it up. Change sides, up and over. Around. And over. Take a nice big look to the one side. Big stretch in the neck over to the other side. And we go over. And over. Back to the center, ear to the shoulder. Feel that big pull inside the neck. And over. 
One more each side, over and over. Back to the center, look to the side, down to your shoulder, half circle forward. Feel it stretch in the back of your neck, take it down again. Two more. Now look down at your shoulder and I want you to take your head diagonally up. So across the front, up to the opposite corner. And then diagonally down to your shoulder. And up, opposite corner. And down one more. And up. And down. Take the head forward and looking down at the shoulder, diagonally up and down. Do you want to get the side of your face flat? And down, one more, and up. Mobilizing to the neck and take it back. Nice big shoulder roll back and interlace your fingers behind your back. Pull your arms down. So you're in this open chest position. And then you're going to bend your elbows, slide your shoulders up and bend your head backwards, squeezing into the back of your head, constricting the blood flow and then we release it. And the blood rushes up. And two more. Squeeze it up. Head goes back, shoulders are up, and release. And one more. And down. Keep the head down, and you're going to look side to side, like a little windscreen wiper. <laughs> And then hold it in the center, breathe in. As we exhale, draw into your tummy, release your hands slowly and stop rolling down. All the way to the bottom. Keep your chin tucked in, shake your head out. And nod your head up and down. And again, left to right. Up and down. Hold it there, tuck your chin into your chest. Take a deep breath into the back of your ribs. Exhale, draw into your tummy and roll it up. Reach the arms forward, open up your chest and roll it down again. Hold it at the bottom, you're going to bend in your knees, a nice deep bend, and exhale, stretch into the back of the legs, wake up those hamstrings, and bend, and stretch, bend, stretch for three, bend, and two, bend, one, hold it there, Start lifting your head and your chest, lengthening to your spine, sliding your hands up your shins, extend into your back, and then fold forward. And up again, lengthen, 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 and fold forward. And three, extend and lengthen, pull your shoulders back. And lower last to grabbing and a slight pull. Lengthen, lifting it up, breathe it. And down. One more. Lifting it up. Then release it down. Soft bend in your knees and roll it up.
Swing the arms backwards. Pull your shoulders down. Connect your ribs and abdominals. And we're going to hinge forward with a soft bend in the knees. Keep your arms lifting up, up, up. You're lengthening out of your sit bones and out of your fingertips. And then release it down and roll it up. Take the arms backwards again. Shoulders draw down. Hinge. One more like this. Rock. Take it back. Shoulders down and hinge. Hold it in the center. Keep lengthening out of your fingertips and coccyx. Take your one arm swing all the way back and pull your fingertips away from each other. And change. Reach. Keep your abdominals drawing in. Make sure you're not arching. And reach. Two. Three. Four. Five. Take both arms forward, hold it there. We're going to bend the elbows, pull back for five, and reach forward, and pull, four, reach, three, keep the arms lifted high, two, and one, reach forward, Lengthen, lengthen all the way down to the floor. Keep going, keep going, and release it down. Well done. Grab behind your knees and pull your body up. Releasing into the spine. I want you to keep holding here and stretching into the one leg. Feel that pull across the body. Change the other side. One more on each side, change legs, pull. Feel the pull moving into your lower back, into your QL and change. Back to the center and roll it all the way up. Good. You're gonna take your hands in front of you in a deep bend here. We're gonna take the leg back, tap, bring it in, open it up, Close one more, open and close. So same leg, tap back and in. Open, if you wanna put your hands into your hips, you can open and we go for three. Tap and in, using that supporting glute. Open, close, open and four. Open. Open, five, open, and six. Make sure that when you open your hips are stable, facing the front, the work is happening in your hip sockets. Seven, and there's stability in your sporting leg. Three more. Eight, should be feeling your glutes working, the supporting glutes. And your thigh. And nine, almost there. One more. Ten. And lifting it all the way up. Just roll it out into your back. And bring it back. Bend into the knees, arms are either forward or on your hips. You're gonna take the other leg back, tap, and in. Open and close. Open. One more. Two. Take it back. Two. Tap. Open. And open. And three. Check your hips with your hands. Open. And four, there's no excessive moving, open. Stay low, five. Halfway there, five more. And we go for six. Seven. 
seven. You feel your supporting glute working, your quad. Two more. Nine. Open, close. Last one. Ten. Open, open, and roll up. Open up the chest and release. You're going to take your hands either in front of you or behind your head for a little bit of a challenge. Take quite a big lunge back. We're going to lift the leg up for two. So you're using your glutes and we're lifting it up for one, tap. Two, tap, bring it in, round the spine, drink into your abdominals, and take it back. And two, use that glute. Two, bring it in. If you need to, you can stand just off the mat for some more support and stability. Three, three, bring it in. And four, four, and in. Take it back. Five, five, and in. And we go for six. In, and seven, almost there. We're going to stretch up the back nicely just now. And eight. Last two. And nine. So we're really working into your spine extensors, your glutes, your abdominals, your stability, balance, ten. And release it. Well done. Turn to the other side. Hands either in front of you or behind your head, on your hips if you need. You take it back, flex the foot, and lifting it up. One, two, and lifting it in. Take it back, and two. In. Round the spine, join to your tummy. Five. Half living. If you need a little two second break, take it and then join us again. Six. Seven, almost there, and up, eight, last two, and nine, one more, and it. And then release it, stepping back onto your mat if you're off. And we're gonna roll all the way down. And just again, stretching, kind of stretching into your legs and rounding your spine. And then I want you to release it into the center. Grab both your hands around your front ankle, bend your legs and stretch your back leg. Only the back leg stretches, but you're holding the front side. And I want you to feel that pull all the way down, side of the back, into the hip, and release. Two more. And stretch. Pull. And release. One more. And pull. And release, take it over to the other side. Grab around the ankle and the calf, bend both legs. 
You're holding the back leg, you're stretching the front leg. Feel that pull into the side of your body. And bend, two more. And stretch. And bend, and stretch. And bend, release it at the bottom and walk your hands forward into your upstretch position. And I want you to push your body backwards, lifting your glutes up to the ceiling. Press your heels down and then walk your toes two little steps in and we're dropping the knees just above the mat. Shoulders are above your hands and we're holding it here for five and four. Lengthen through the spine. Three, two, and one. You're going to drop your knees down to tap. Use your abdominals to lift them up again. Five, and ten, four, three, two, one. Stretch the legs back up. Take two little steps back with your feet. Lift the glutes up, lengthen through the tailbone. And we round the spine as you draw into your tummy for our spinal wave. Round, round, round. Extend through the spine from your plank, lifting the chest. Don't break the line of the neck. So it's lengthened. And stretch it up. Round, scoop. Length and extend. We're mobilizing that spine around. Scoop. Use your abdominals. Press it back. Last two like this. Round. And extend. And one more like this. And extend. Through the spine, stretch the legs. Now we're taking it with a straight spine the whole time for the last five. Lean it forward into your plank. Five. Lifting it up. Inhale. And exhale forward for four. And and three. And up. Two. Up and one. Hold it here, last for five, four, three, two, one. And lifting the, the glutes up, drop the knees down, press back into your rest position. Well done. Deep breath in. Take your hands over to the one side and pull your body away. Feel that nice stretch into the side. Over to the other side and pull. Back to the center, reach the fingertips forward. You're gonna take your body forward Cross your um, feet behind you. Keep dropping your glutes, but then lifting your chest up. Opening the chest, stretching into the back. And then around. So your hands stay where they are so you can stretch. And then cross the feet. And lengthen for four. Keep your tummy pulling in here. So you're sinking into your lower back and pressing it back. For three, lengthen, extend, shoulders pull back, open your chest. 
and two. And back. And the last one. Open. And back. You do the same thing, but with a press up. So I want you to keep your body straight here. Don't extend or drop the glutes. Nice, strong body lifting into the abdominals, but your feet are crossed at the back still. We're doing three inhales down, one exhale up. In, 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 exhale up. And go as low as you can. And we're going in, 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 exhale up. As long as you're keeping your body in a straight line. In. Two more. In, in, in. And in. Note which foot is on top of the other one. And do your feet stretch it out. We're going to do that one more time. Just the feet cross the other way. Reaching forward, other leg goes on top. Nice strong line. And we're bending for five. So we go in, two, three, press it up. All right. In, four. Elbows are tucked in towards your body. In, three. Almost there. In, two. And last one. One. Well done. Press back. Breathe. And then roll it up. And grab a sip of your water. Good warm up. <laughs> Jokes. Okay. Swing your legs around. Rolling all the way down. Hands pressing down into the floor. Feet are together to start. Open your heels, open your toes. There's a little gap under your back. We're going to lengthen into the spine, lengthen the coccyx away from you, pressing the lower back into the mat, just for three, breathe in, back to neutral, exhale, think pelvic floor, TA, draw down, close your ribs. One more like this. And in, rolling all the way up. Also three like this. Inner thighs are engaged. They parallel. Your pubic bone is tilted towards your nose. And it stays tilted towards the nose the whole roll down. And then it releases at the bottom. Two more. Evenly as you can. Make sure your hips are square and down. One more. And we're going to hold it here. Really squeeze into your front glutes and you're going to lift your back foot up and stretch it up to the ceiling. We're going to lower that leg, flex and lift it up. One. Point in lower, and two. Now, if you want, you can keep your leg bent and just do taps. Three. Four. Five. Keep the body stable. Six. Seven. Almost there. Eight. Last two. Nine. 10, bend the leg, place it down, square off your hips. Other leg comes up, stretches up to the ceiling or it stays bent. 
and it taps down one and up. two. Keep the body still. Three, four, five, halfway there. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Lifting up, bend the leg, place it down, square off the hips, and roll. And then just hug your legs into your chest for a moment and roll side to side, just releasing into your spine. Keep your arms lifted, I mean your legs um, at 90 degrees, your arms are lifting up, open up to a T position. If you want, you can take it into a cactus with bent arms or stretch the fingertips out. We're going to take the legs forward towards me. Inhale, keep your shoulders flat on the floor. And exhale. Connect, connect, connect. Obliques, abdominals. And inhale, over. Exhale. Your chest is open. Your head stays forward. Inhale. Shoulders are flat. And in. So you only take the legs as low as you can keep your shoulder blades flat on the floor. And exhale. One more on each side. In. And over. Keep your legs up, reach your arms backwards. Inhale. And exhale, lift arms, head, chest, stretch into the legs. Take it back with control. And exhale, two. And in. Now really concentrate on drawing your navel down. Three. And in. Squeezing your inner thighs together. Four. Five. We're going to add a leg in here, the cord, and exhale. Six. Open and close with resistance. Bend and stay high, and then release it down. And exhale. Bend. Lift up and down. Three more. Last two. And one. Inhale. Exhale, lifting it up. Grab behind your thighs, place off a little bit higher. You're going to stretch your back leg, both hands on top of your front knee. And we change. Two, three, four, keep pushing, five, six, keep your chin tucked in, eight, if your neck is hurting, come up higher, nine, ten, well done, release it down. Roll your head on the mat from side to side. Grab behind your thighs again, nod your head. Exhale, use your abdominals and lift yourself up. Nice pull, interlace your hands behind the head. Rotate towards me, stretch your back leg. One, we change. One, and two. Two, three, four, stay high, five, you're keeping past your thighs, six, seven, eight, 
seven, eight, nine, and ten. Back to the center, release it down. Well done. Turn over onto your tummy. And just give yourself a little push up. Shoulders are down. Opening your chest, breathing here, releasing the abdominals. One more deep breath. And then release it all the way down. You're going to turn onto your side. You can either be lying down on your arm like this, or you can come up slightly onto your elbow and making use of your tricep. Hand behind the head, other one either in front of you, on your side, or behind your head. You're going to lift the top leg up, flex the foot, and squeeze. Use your inner thighs, use your abdominals. Inhale, lift and lengthen. And two. And in. Three. Point and lengthen. Flex and lengthen. Four. Five. Reach it away. Six. We're thinking of lengthening those muscles. Seven. Long and strong. And eight. Two more. Ten. Little circles, keeping the body still as still as you can. And reverse in. Lift it up and down. You can lie all the way flat. Palm is facing up, other hand on top of your thigh or in front of you. Lift the top leg up, lift the bottom leg up to join, and then lower. Try not to rock back. Inhale, inhale, and exhale, using your obliques. And in, in, in. Your bottom shoulders pulling down. Four more. Last one. We breathe in. And exhale with both legs. Make sure you don't shame from your abdominals. Inhale lower. And two. And in. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and hold. Lower the bottom leg and squeeze it up for ten and nine. Done, bend your legs, <clears throat> press yourself up onto your elbow, reach this top arm up and over, and press yourself away. So, you need a nice stretch into the side, <sighs> breathing here. So, your hip and your fingertips are pulling in opposite directions. Deep breath in. And we're going to twist down to face the floor. Get that nice rotation stretch. <sighs> and then release it. Spin your legs around to the other side. So you can 
either lie down on your hand like this or lift your elbow up slightly and get use of the triceps and the knee. Lifting the top leg up, flex and squeeze down. Use your inner thighs and abdominals. In, squeeze, two. In, three. Five. Think of abdominals. Nine. Ten little circles. Flex the foot and we circle one. And two. Last set. Three. Reverse. Lift it up and lower, reaching all the way down, palm is up, shoulder drawing down. We lift the top leg up, draw into your tummy, bottom leg up and lower. In, in, and five. Six, using your abdominals. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Breathe in. Exhale, lift both legs, draw into your tummy. One, and low. Two. Going for five. Nine. Last one, ten and hold. Lower the bottom leg, squeeze it up, ten. And nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Bend the legs, press yourself up onto your elbow, reach the arm up and over. Pressing your hip away from you, lifting your ribs up. One more deep breath and turn down towards the mat. Feel that nice rotation, stretch. One more breath and press yourself up. Open your legs wide. I'm just checking the time. I'm just going to reach it over and outside and reach and up and over. Reach. Lift it up, turn to face your leg and hinge forward. Lifting it up and over. Up, face your leg, hinge forward. Back up to the center and creep your hands forward. See how far you can go. Can you go a little further, a little further? Can you get your elbows down? Can you relax here just for a moment? Good. 
Last breath. Press yourself up. Bring your legs in. Shake them out. And then I want you to roll forward, reach, reach, reach. Lift your fingertips. Three more like this. Roll forward. And lift up. And two. Up. Last one. And I want you to hold it there just for a moment. Pull down. And I'm lifting it up. And you're going to bend your legs. Turn over onto your hands and knees. Tuck your toes underneath. Press into your up stretch. Lengthen through the spine. Walk your feet towards your hands. Drop your chin into your chest and roll it up. Nice and slow. Big shoulder roll back for three. And two. One. Reach the arms forward. Open your chest and release it down. And the arms go out to the sides. Inhale. They come forward in front of your face. And well done, everybody. And just shake it out. Shake your cheek, shoulders, hips, knees, hands and feet. And there you go. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful day, everybody.